following tag team contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 456 pounds, Tyler Breeze and Fandango. This is it. This is the match we've all been waiting for. And the electricity level in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt. At a combined weight of 487 pounds, Connor and Victor, the Ascension. Connor looking as scary as ever tonight. Yeah, I expect big things from Connor in this one. Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. Guys, there's nothing like a good old-fashioned tag team match. And it's worth noting that we are just a few miles from the WWE Performance Center, which means there are plenty of WWE hopefuls in the back studying this one. Tell us about Connor. What does he need to do to make sure his team comes out on top here? I know it's early, but he and his partner really seem to be clicking tonight, Cole. I'm sure he can pick up the slack if needed, but I don't think he wants to go down that path. Tyler Breeze is modeled all over the world and continues to be his own biggest fan. But when it comes to competing in the ring, Breeze knows how to win and knows how to inflict serious harm on his opponents. As infatuated as Tyler Breeze is with himself, the definition of delish possesses the ring awareness to sense an opponent's weakness, capitalize on it, and be relentless in doing so. Tyler Breeze has been an influencer in the fashion world for years. Tyler's not his own biggest fan, you idiots. Prince Pretty just knows his worth. Breeze also knows how to physically and mentally batter an opponent. And by the way, Byron, I loathe you. This is some great offense by Tyler Breeze. We've super kicked, but did he go for it too early? He's lining him up. He's looking at it. Yeah. 
Hoping to end it here. Oh boy, this could be it. The muscles and bones may not be able to withstand the force. The anguish may be too great. Connor looking completely hapless. This is not where he wants to be at this point in this tag team match. Unless he has no interest in walking away with the winner's end of the purse, he needs to make a tag immediately. Big miss for him there. And he'll likely pay for it here. Connor with a nice reversal. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. The switch here to Victor. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big time damage, Michael. Disqualify this man. Well, time will tell if he can sustain this kind of effort. Victor is getting ready here. It's heating up now. Let me tell you, the human body was not meant to be slammed like that. Uh-oh. I'm afraid to think what's going to happen next. <laughs> oh, and an excruciatingly painful face buster. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. Nobody ever accused Fandango of being shot. You better be careful here. And what a reversal from Victor. Look at Connor putting on a show, and the crowd is eating it up. Here he goes. Thunderbomb! That one definitely hurt, Cole. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. No, he's taking one heck of a beating, Michael. How could Tyler Breeze just dig deeper right now and find his way out of this one? This tag team match is dangerously close to getting out of control. There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. He is a one-man gang in there. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. There's the switch. Victor is in. He's not getting up. You can't like his chances right now. Fontango with a nice reversal. And there's the reversal from Victor.
What do you think Fandango needs to do to get back in this battle? If they want to win this match, he really needs to make a tag soon. This is not the time to be a hero. To keep this match from slipping away, he needs to get his partner in there and take a break. This is one of the more evenly matched contests we've seen in quite some time. From the looks of things, it could really go either way. Victor with the STO in the corner. So impressive. In comes Connor. There it is, the fall of man. Fonda. This could do it. And there's the breakup, just in the nick of time. Showing very few signs of life here. Yeah, there's no way he comes back from this. Might as well ring the bell now. Yeah, it's obvious that something got into him. We know what's coming here. And a flapjack. Warm up the bus. This one is over. This could be it for him, guys. Yeah, he's on Dream Street. Oh, yeah, here's Carter. One move after the other. It's devastating. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. Hmm. Hmm. Don goes on the attack now. Hmm. That'll change his posture in a hurry. Looking for the quick pin. One, two. Oh, man, I thought he had him. Hey, I guess you never know. What does Victor need to do now to remain a factor in this match? His hopes of winning this tag team match are starting to dwindle. The abuse his body has gone through in this match is a little disturbing. I don't know why he hasn't made the tag yet. It's on the cross. Dance. Fondango is just sucking. His shoulders are down. Two. That could have been it right there. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. Can't stay vertical after the belly-to-belly -belly suplex. Just carrying the opposition here. But you can't carry your opponent all day. You gotta make a move eventually. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. Victor is moving the momentum to his corner. Ain't no stopping him now. Oh, the brutal STO. Fondango just kidding. This should do it right there. Now that's an impressive tag team victory. three count ends this one and there's your winner folks talk about making your presence felt in the match wow what a win we've got an animated crowd here tonight as we usually do when we're in orlando